All right. Um, I've uh, had quite a few videos on here, um, and um, they're all uh, very interesting. Um, I've had a, quite an interesting time uh, uh, putting this here. Um, I've, I've, I did um, a while back ago. Um, I did a, uh, a presentation. Uh, I did a presentation um, in front of a um, uh, at a community center. It was a class on uh, death and dying, and um, I did a I gave a very brief um, presentation on my near death experience, and it seemed like uh, at first I think um, everybody was just kind of um, not. Uh, I think they were very skeptical. Let's just put it that way. And then, you know, they didn't know who I was. And so the present, the, um, at first it was very difficult. But um, as I started talking uh, um, and I started to talk about my near-death experience, um, I, see, I seemed to have a, a much greater, it seemed like they had a much greater respect for me. And also I had a much better command of the audience which were I think there were uh, about seven people in the in the class I think and I think I had about uh, I think there were like four four five women and three men um, in the whole group and so anyways um, uh, um, and, and some of them were more religiously inclined as well so they had their religious kind of um, um, thinking and um, I, I think I, I definitely captured their beliefs and, and their imagination it, it felt like they were kind of in a hypnotic trance almost at a certain point in time their just eyes were just like wide open and, and, and very uh, they seemed very very um, intrigued um, interested and um, uh, forward thinking it's almost like I was um, um, helping in their evolution of, of knowledge, thought, and uh, spiritual spiritual evolution, which 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 was quite nice. Now that I talk about this, um, I haven't ever realized it. I I think it was a feeling. I think it's a um, mind feeling connection. Of, um, if you think something and then you have the feeling that it's right, then your mind and your feelings are working together, and so your intuition, your feelings are working together, which is a very very good thing. Uh, I had a and a a question and answering session, um, and I think um, one of the questions, they, they asked me many questions such as um, um, uh, what, uh, you know, what, uh, what, what is, um, I can't really memorize every single question, but I'm sure that the audience um, was able to know what, you know, what, what questions and answers were there. Um, I, th I think the last question was um, um, uh, I don't remember the last question but I think I, I remember my answer which was um, I, I think I think I think um, I think there was like this um, explanation of what the loving force and the connection with the loving force and I I, I think there was this question about um, um, uh, the connection to the loving force. So I just I just kind of briefly um, made a joke um, saying that um, um, you know, like all religions, I don't really you know you don't really need a middleman. You don't you don't need you know a, a preacher or a priest or a or a um, or a human being to 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 connect with the loving force, and I I think that's like the major problem most people have, um, you know, and um, you know if if I were to like start my own philosophy and technology on how to interpret the loving force and how to connect with the loving force, I think the best thing to do is. Um, first human beings on this planet have to realize where the loving force resides um, the uh, the loving force is uh, resides inside um, each one of our hearts so that's the living uh, the loving forces place is in our living hearts um, it, it actually resides within us so 
the loving force, God, actually resides, lives within my heart. So I am God. Um, and first, firstly, that is um, that is a that is a knowing and a belief that all human beings have to acknowledge and to to work with um, in order to um, pay attention to their feelings and their intuition and to connect with the loving force. That's the first thing they have to do, which is very difficult because everyone's either Catholic or Buddhist or Muslim or you know Christian or they believe in Jesus or they believe in whatever. Um, whatever they believe in, um, you know, they need to get rid of this and to really concentrate on uh, uh, connecting with this loving uh, energy, uh, which is which is the basis of God, which is which is God basically. Um, secondly, um, I'd like to say that um, um, you can have uh, actually a, a conversation with with the loving force. Um, and it's not like you're talking to yourself, but there, there is, um, everyone's looking for an outside source. Um, um, uh, the loving force, uh, uh, the source, I would say, is the uh, solar sun. So whenever on a uncloudy day, on the daytime, when there's the sun beating down, uh, reflecting off the water or um, coming down on the earth, um, that that is the loving force and you could have a direct communication with the loving force you can actually talk to the solar sun and look straight at it and um well i i, I myself look straight at the solar sun myself um i actually at one point in my uh, death was uh, part of this the solar sun the loving force and so uh for some reason i could stare directly at the solar sun and just have a direct conversation um, um, for you know however long I need to um, I'm, I'm sure that most people might not uh, think this a good idea but um so um, let's see here yeah and that's um, I, I think that's that's kind of a start to if if I really had any type of religion uh, that would be it um, that would be the two basic points of my religion um, I think uh, there was a Q&A and the last question basically was how to um, where my uh, communication um, there need there always needs to be direct communication and there also needs to be the knowing that um, this loving force will always be there and will always um, um, help in all all time, um, and always be there for um, 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 any 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 moment. And so there 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 really should be no despair. But at the same time, um, uh, human beings I think have been led down the wrong road, and um, in the future they should um, start looking towards. Um, something much more technologically and spiritually advanced civilization uh, a civilization that no longer relies on um, um, basically everything um, we need to get rid of um, every everything every everything that that human beings have learned need to be discarded and a new spiritual te technological science and uh, spirituality there needs to be a bridge and um, there needs to be um, a new way of uh, thinking a new way of um, uh, living